So uh, again, you, you brought up another thing where you're um, a leader, uh, this three layer stacking, as you call it. It seems to me, as I understand it, maybe you can explain it better. Uh, you have a lot of competing um, parameters when you're trying to design a, a camera with high performance, low power consumption, uh, small footprint, uh, quick response, uh, good infrared, in, good visible. Um, can you illuminate that a little more? Uh, no, sure, sure. Love to talk about that. So, you know, three way for stacking, two way for stacking. The idea of stacking is relatively simple. What we want to do is we want to make sure that the size of the die itself is limited by the number of pixels. So that's obviously as small as we can physically make it. But another thing that's very important in stacking is that often the technology that you need to build the best pixels so that you can get high quantum efficiency, high modulation transfer function, very low read noise, high full capacity, is not the same process that's really good for digital logic and may also not be the same process that's the best for analog readout. And if you build something like a three-way for stack, we can optimize each layer for the type of functionality. So you imagine the top are pixels, in between maybe our analog readout, and then at the bottom is all of our digital. And we can pick the most aggressive process for the digital so that we can have very low power dissipation. We can pick a very low noise um, kind of mix mode uh, process for the, the middle wafer for doing analog. And on top, we can have an optimized process specifically for uh, collecting photons. 